my god. <laughs> Oh, God. Gator, what have you been... E oh. Oh. oh! What? Well, it's 8 o'clock in the morning. And, um... <laughs> and Salty Lass... Well, it's all right. And Salty yeah, Lass is up in the cradle. That means it's... That means it's a... Uh, splash day. Diversion. I think they're intending to park this beastie beside us. Should be interesting to watch. It's absolutely huge. Right, Gainer, what's going on today? Somebody's been nicking me power, Bev. <laughs> Who would do such a thing? Maybe we can find a guilty party. <laughs> you can take your cable somewhere else, mate. <laughs> this yard is not the best to get jobs done because all the old grease is just caked in sand. So, you're going to have to get that out and, um, you know, get rid of it, really. Get rid of the sand. And it goes all the way up, I think. Or is that it? Yeah. That's it. Spanking on it, Beverly. Yeah, okay, let's slide that prop on. Yay. Right. First job of the day was to fit the new bracket for the masthead light. We then had to adapt the existing wiring to connect with it. And Gainer's love of tools came in very handy at this point. It's amazing what you get excited about. Um, currently I'm excited about our new mane. What a fantastic colour. Uh, we've just put on the topping lift, uh, so we've got a new topping lift, and this is going to be our new um, main halyard. So what are you doing, Bev? Botching up the sewing. <laughs> Botching up the sewing. Yeah, go away. <laughs> go away. This is the stitch of shame. <laughs> What's your glasses on, so I can't see what I'm doing. Oh, okay. Um, That's probably what went wrong. <laughs> yeah, but uh, basically, Beverly is sewing on. Um, a toggle so that we will have a a toggle <laughs> and a loop for our flag hoists so she's done that yeah um you can just see here look at that blue rope look at all so, our gorgeous ropes so um the blue rope was the main yeah uh, so that's now been put through uh, along with uh, the ropes are New topping lift. lift. Spinnaker lift. Uh, spinnaker hoist. A spinnaker. Halyard. Uh, sp spinnaker halyard. And then the spinnaker pole lift. And the spinnaker pole lift. So they are gorgeous. They are indeed. Of all the ropes that I really, really wanted was the spinnaker. It's just for me, it's a dream of a sail I haven't yet got, but at least now I can get a spinnaker. <gasps> You might want to hurry up with this explanation because they're bringing the hoist again. I know, noise is going to stop any second. Bev spraying the track uh, with um, dry a dry lube. So basically it... Um, uh, it's a lubricant, but um, it actually uh, dries um, and doesn't leave a residue. So that's what she's doing. I should really be used 
to um, plans going out the window by now, but I'm not because Pev and I had got this plans to do our um, sewage and get that all sorted, but apparently the guy who's doing our mast is going on holiday, so we've got to get the mast on today. So what the heck, at least that means that we will actually get the mast on and Salty Lass will at least look like she's a sailboat rather than a motor cruiser. So at least that's a win. Our new, um, what type of um, bottle screws are these? Because these aren't bottle screws, are they? Yeah, these are bottle screws. Yeah, but they're a particular... Yeah, they're an upgrade off the normal ones. Trilocks? Super, super... Can't quite remember the name. But they're an upgrade, aren't they, on That's our uh, on our bottle screws? But don't they look gorgeous? Super just, super just, stay lock super just. Oh, stay lock super just. Yeah, so um, we're getting uh, new um, bottle screws on. Somewhere over there is our mast. Exciting things are happening to our mast. There certainly are exciting things are happening as they uh, try and pull our mast up and they're going to be uh, bringing it across in a minute but Bev and I are trying to uh, sort out the main sheet in the meantime. Better be, hurry up so I'll best get back to it. Yeah I'm going to come over there now because otherwise um, I'm in trouble of uh, getting a, a, a mast hit on my head. Put a bit of, onto a cleat, put a little bit of weight So what they're doing, what they're doing at the moment is we're using the topping lift as a temporary backstay. Well Pev and I have just um, put on the, um, what, what was it, which particular um, it was the, um, mainsail? No, it was the uh, kicker shackle we put it on. Oh no, we've just put the kicker shackle on, the one, one that's white and red with yellow flecks. Maybe, or the main sheet. The main sheet. We've just put the main sheet on. And I think we put it on about four times before. Fourth, yeah, it's about the fourth time it's gone on. <laughs> it's the fourth time before before we were up. We thought, we, the yes. Blocks, the block system isn't particularly obvious. <laughs> before, yes, we knew we had it right. So, and um, we're just having this, uh, our rigging tensioned at the moment. So, this is a, a tensioner, isn't it? This is a lose gauge. A, a what gauge? By the end of the day we still had a lot of tidying up to do. But the mast was on and Salty Lass looked lovely. The next morning we did the tidying up and then move to the next job on the list, which was rather less pleasant. Well, our new through holes have uh, arrived. Uh, this is our old uh, through hole, definitely our worst one. As you can see, it's just all brittle and bleh. So that definitely needed replacing. Um, and uh, we're going to be replacing it with, look at this, it's so shiny. <laughs> So we're going to be replacing it with um, this rather large one. We might need to cut the threads down a little bit, but we'll uh, get it all dry fitted before we uh, even attempt to think about things like that. I'm sneaking around here because there's a vice in here that I can appropriate. I mean, they're a good bunch in the yard. I'm sure as long as nobody tells them I was in here, I'll get away with it. Well, that's that bit off. So hopefully I've got everything right. Soon find out. So what's happening, Gainer? This time I've got the, uh, <coughs> the end of the stick and I'm helping, uh, we're, help we're replacing all the um, plumbing pipes. Let's give it the proper title. You're replacing the... SH. 
noses. <laughs> the word you're looking for is sewage. Oh, is it? Is it? Is it sewage? <laughs> That's so polite, Beverly. So polite. Mm. Oh my god! <laughs> oh my god! Oh god, Gator, what have you been? E oh. 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 What have you been eating? God almighty, girl, that's disgusting. That's not just me, girl. That's you as well. But, boy, luckily there's no smell of vision on this uh, YouTube channel. Because you don't want to know. <laughs> oh, you don't, do you? Oh. No wonder uh, this um, old sewage pipe doesn't flex. Have you seen the amount of calcium in there? We're having to take it out in sections. And it's just ridiculous. I think calling it calcium is rather polite. There's a shorter word for it, Anglo-Saxon, four letters. Yeah, I know, but it's got loads of calcium in there, so we'll take it out in sections. Monday. Well, we're supposed to be in on Monday. Yeah. This is the last major job. Supposed to be in today, but because we both were sick during the week. Yeah, because I'm afraid to I caught Jenny Belly and then of course we're going to Beverly. Yeah. So you that's plugged up the pipe thing. No, yeah. no, we go to the marina for things like that. Right, just gainer, put your foot on that. Oh yeah. Yeah, just stand up. Just, that's it. Just just stand in there. That that that's brilliant. I just thought you like might like to appear on YouTube. This is this is new tube, Beverly, not YouTube. Things are not going well here on Salty Lass. Words have been said and not polite, gorgeous, nice words. More like, etc. I see cock that we thought was hey okay has now been removed. And Bev's in the process of cleaning it all off because we've got to do it again. Um, when she was screwing it all up, uh, you broke the thread. Or the seal, she broke the seal, um, which was something I was a bit concerned about when, because when we were screwing it up, it it was just difficult. <sighs> but we screwed up, but not the way we intended. Yeah, we did. We screwed up, but not the way we should have. But anyway, <sighs> we will persevere because else you've got else. What else you've got to do? There's nothing else you can do but just get on with it. Well, it's eight o'clock in the morning. And um, <laughs> and salty lass, well, it's all right. And salty yeah, lass nice. is up in the cradle. Uh, uh, that means ladder, it's please, that means it's a uh, splash day. They go on about um, cruising being a different lifestyle, and it certainly is. It's not even nine o'clock. I've um, painted the bottom of the keel. I've uh, got blue all off my hands and I'm now dressed and in a travel um, lift. lift. So I'm swaying about and so it's completely and utterly different to my previous life which was sitting, sitting at behind a desk. desk. So, you know, if you want a different life, this is definitely it. If you want a different life, get a desk. Nice antifoil gainer. Has anyone got any barnacles in your head? I've also been told I won't get any nits either. Oh golly. Yep, she's going back in the water. Well that's our one seacock and that looks fine. Um, but okay. This is our other seacock, and as you can see, we have a drip. So, hopefully, a man is going to come and fix that. Well, the man has come and he has um, done the seacock, he's put the the it's, it, it's um, the handles in a different position. And hopefully we can actually open and close that. So I'm going to have a go at that in a second. Uh, but it's on. And uh, hopefully this time it will work. So Gainer, just to check. 
Are we back aboard or are we back aboard? We're back aboard. Woohoo! We're back but, aboard! Um, well, uh, we had a guy fix our seat up because um, in a fraction of the time we took. Yep. Um, but that's all sorted and it's not leaking now, which is real. Um, but we've just got to clean the boat. It's, it, she's a sandy lass, not a bloody... Salty lass. Salty lass. No, she's salty. covered in sand from the yard. We need to get it all out. Yeah. So it's cup of tea time. Yeah. And then it's start tidying the boat time. Certainly is. No rest for the wicked. But she's back in her old slip. Uh, facing the other way around because of the wind, but that's the way it is. Hello. I'm really happy and I'm tired already. Yeah. <laughs> it's only 11 o'clock. <laughs> and the gas kettle's on because we've no idea where the electric one is. It's probably somewhere in there. Somewhere. Maybe. Perhaps. We've got, the, we've got the top, we just haven't got, got the bottom. the bottom, yeah, so. But lots to do. All these tools have to be sorted out. All this disaster zone has to be fixed. So, are we going to be bored today? I don't think so, Bob. I don't think we're going to be bored today, either. Let's get the tea and toast on the go. Oh, absolutely. With marmalade. Yay! Yay!